What's up my dudes, Val Kieran. Today, I was gonna make a video about why I wanted Ching Yi over Zhu Yuan. I was. It's only a week until uh, Zhu Yuan goes away. And I started like listening my reasons out why, which I'll, I'll probably play the video at the end of this, but I wanted to give you guys context and pretext of what occurred during it. And basically, I was listening out the reasons why, is I wanna make a really good team for Jane Doe. And I started to have the realization that I can make a team for Jane Doe and Nicole if I just get Zhu Yuan because then I'm able to trigger the support skill for Jane Doe and Nicole in the same team and Zhu Yuan is going to be able to appear provide a bunch of burst damage and then disappear as well as really good disorder with the assault disorder uh, applied with the ether assault ether disorder so I'll get a really good disorder I'll get the synergy I want. I'll have burst DPS through Zhu Yuan while having main on-field damage with Jane Doe. Meaning that the best team for me to be able to use the fa the characters I have are my favorite characters, which are specifically going to be Jane Doe and Nicole is getting Zhu Yuan. So like I said, I'll play the other video after this. I just want to give you guys context of this because you guys can literally see in the video my realization of what my best team for Jane Doe for me to be able to use my favorite characters actually would be. And it is Zhu Yuan, Nicole, and Jane Doe. So yeah, now it went from why I'm pulling Ching Yi to now why I'm skipping Ching Yi. Um, yeah, that's basically it. Just wanted to give you guys context to what you're about to see. But yeah, enjoy the rest of the video. So my dudes, Val here. Today I'm going to be talking to you guys about why I am saving up for Ching Yi or why I'm going to get Ching Yi uh, whenever I want Jane Doe. I know I've told you guys before that Jane Doe is my next character I really, really want. So I wanted to make sure to basically let you guys know exactly why I'm going for Ching Yi next. And why I want her, I'm probably slaughtering her name. I hope I'm not. But who knows? I know I can pronounce Jane Doe correctly. So hey, pog on that one. Anyways, um, if you guys know, Ching Yi should be coming here in what? Yeah, about a week. Like literally a week. And whenever she does drop, I'm going to get her. I'm going to get exactly one copy of her. No weapon. I'm going to put like Cohen's weapon on her. Because it'll serve us perfectly fine with it. Because I managed to actually get like Cohen's uh w weapon which uh, it's gonna drive a lot of people nuts i don't put like lycone's w weapon on lycone uh but i'm gonna put it on ching yi and the reason being is because jane doe her synergy she synergizes with uh, either anomaly or uh the cops the uh what is it the neps new air do police station so she either synergizes with neps or anomaly right so, because of that, I either want to run her with an Anomaly character or one of the uh, Neps characters. And the one that's going to benefit her the most, in my opinion, is going to be Ching Yi. Because Ching Yi is going to be able to trigger break constantly and be able to go really, really crazy with that. The other option I could potentially see myself doing is actually Zhu Yuan with Nicole. And then Jane Doe. Wait. It actually sounds like a really good idea. All right, you know what? I'm going to let the 50-50 decide. I am 150-50 away. I either run Nicole and Zhu Yuan or run... Either run Nicole, Zhu Yuan, and Jane Doe or I run um, Ching Yi and uh, Jane Doe. Yeah, because I was going to pull her for it, but now that I'm thinking about it, and it's just better just to run Zhu Yuan. That way I have more burst up time. Huh. You know what? We let the 50-50 decide. We let we let the man almighty upstairs decide. Literally the very last one. Alright, so let's see. There we go. That's what I'm talking about. Nicole, yeah. Alright, so, we just let this happen, because I'm on 50-50 right now. So this decides. I double Nicole? Okay. And then right here. Nope, next one. I'm bad at counting. Alright, there we go. So I wasn't going to get her, 
But then, whenever I'm sitting there talking about it out loud, I just had the realization that I could have a ton of burst damage up time and get her. I wonder if that... Is that enough to actually, like, max out my Nicole, too? It is. Nice. So, yeah. Yeah, now I, I've already decided. Like, I was going to go with Xin Yi for the stun up time. But now that I realize that, why not just have the Giga Burst? And then I also really like Nicole. If you guys don't know, I like Nicole a lot. So now I could just pivot and do this instead. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Catch you guys in the next one. Peace.